Hello, and welcome to Let's Play uh, Link's Awakening. So, after a long week, we, uh, weekend of doing absolutely nothing, it is now Monday, so I am starting this Let's Play like I said I would. Um, yeah, so here's the starting. It was a boat, there was a storm, and now someone's on a beach. Alright. Look, she's running, and there's some boy there. What the hell? Okay, then. Tries to wake him up. And then it goes up to some random egg. Interesting. And, crap, I forgot to set up my controller, so... Be right back. Okay, now that that's set up, I can actually play. And I really don't know what that file is. I'll go ahead and erase it. And here we go. Go ahead and write this in. D H E L M. It fit nicely. Alright, so, now I wake up from a dream. How odd. That's how Ocarina of Time stop starts. What a relief. I thought you'd never wake up. You, you were tossing and turning. What? Zelda? No, my name's Marin. You must be still be f feeling a little woozy. You are the, on the Koholint... Koholint... Island. Okay. Let's talk to this guy. Well, D Helm, you finally snapped out of it. Snapped out of it. Name's Terran. Hope you're feeling better. What? How did I know your name? You think it was weird, eh? Well, I saw it on the back of this shield. So that's how you get your shield. Press the button, repel enemies with it. That's gonna be needed to get to your sword, because you still don't have that. Let's talk to her again. Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the area. Well, that's horrible. So be careful. Well, okay. Hey, what are you doing in my chest? Where'd you learn to do such a thing? Oh, sorry. Wow, this looks pretty heavy. You won't be able to lift it with just your bare hands. There's a lot of items like that so far. Anyway, so, follow the path. I'm doing horrible at it so far. And look, it's Mario. It's a chain chomp. Anyway, following the path. Let's see what this kid. Hey man, when you want to save, just push all the buttons at once. Uh, don't ask me what that means. I'm just a kid. Okay then. I've actually never been able to do that. My controller won't allow it. Oh well. Well, it seems that after you save, you'll start at the last door you went through. I'm not really sure why that is, because I'm just a kid. And? Following the path. Jump. Jump at a jump. Jumping. Still can't kill enemies. Escaping. And going back, because I went the wrong way. And continuing, hopefully I don't run into any enemies. Oh well. And... Crap. Oh yeah. Crap. I could have gone that way the whole time. I feel lame now. And there's an owl. Hoops, hoops. So you are the lad who owns the sword. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake up the windfish. It is said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the windfish. You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there. Hoot. Uh, okay. And yeah, we got our sword. It must be yours because it has your name engraved on it. Well, holy crap. Sword. 
Alright. And now we gotta kill enemies for rupees. Death to you all. Rupee, rupee, rupees. Death. Rupees. What's that sign say? Beware of sea urchins. Don't touch them with your bare hands. Okay. And that creepy owl guy said to go north, so... Heading north. North we go. And there's an acorn. You've got a guardian acorn. It will reduce the damage you take by half. Sweet. <laughs> Rupee. And yeah, north, 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 north. Plants. And I actually can jump down here real quick. For a heart piece. A piece of heart. Sorry. Okay. Push select. I got one out of four. I'm wearing green armor and twelve out of something. All right. Go up here. Mysterious forest. Yep, it's a little bit mysterious. Really? I'm actually gonna go over this way real quick because you can actually go back into this person's house and they'll be gone. So let's see what it is really in this chest. Wow, this is a nice chest. Shh. Fail. Anyway. Yeah, I, I found that funny. Alright, now that we have the sword, we can go back here. Hoot. Ho, oh, brave lad, on your quest to wake the dreamer. Yes, the dreaming windfish. Welcome to the mysterious wood. Much of my mystery you will find on this uncharted Koholant Island. Or Koholant. There we go, Koholant Island. I'm afraid you may find it a trifle difficult to leave the island while the windfish naps. By the by, you... Have you ever visited the Tail Cave, which is south of the village? Go there with the key you find in this forest. The windfish is watching. Hoot. Well, okay then. Go through this mysterious forest with weird, mysterious music. Attack! I'm trying to save up rupees. Because later on, it is required that you buy something for 200 of them. And, uh, it could take quite a while. If you were here when I uploaded this previously, you know that the item is a shovel and what it is used for. If you weren't, well, I just explained it, so blah. Alright, go through this little cave here. Beware of floors with cracks. A heavy person should not stand on them. Well, I shouldn't be too heavy. Link's not fat. No rupees there. No rupees there. Okay then. Crap. Trying to skip the oh suck. Oh well. Doing about the same. You have to use your shield to push through that. Just hold it and go up against it. Alright, and these guys randomly pop out of the floor. And the easiest way just to get through here is that way. You can't get that heart piece yet, as far as I know. You can get it later. And the only reason we came back here is for this mushroom. You pick the toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma flows into your nostrils. Why does he f make stuff float over his head? Doesn't anyone else find that a bit weird? Link, you found a stick. Holds it above his head. 
people looking around just sit there like, um, is that normal for people to be doing that? And Link's friends say, just go with it. I don't think he realizes he does it. Anyway, so we have to go back this way. And, uh, crap, I fell through the floor. And this is a Triforce piece. Or, a piece of power. You can feel the energy flowing through you. Basically, it gives you, give you your attacks more power. And crap, I ended up dying because I was falling through cracks in the floor. Rog. I got the mushroom still, so I messed that up, didn't I? Yes, I did. You can always reset it. There we go. Go ahead, kill these. It's all for the rupees. And quickly not go through there, apparently. Not gonna stand on those for a long time. We learned our lesson. Alright, and now we have the journey to some witch. Which is this way, if I'm correct. Okay. Kill those guys. And cut all these plants because I do want to try and collect a whole bunch of these rupees. And my computer's being loud. Why? I'll move the mic over. Sorry if there was any rumbling there. Like that. Anyway. Kill these guys. What the heck? Bad red. Uh. I don't know what that thing is. I think it's a choo-choo. That's what it reminds me of, so I'm just gonna say it's a choo-choo. Cutting all the grass. Ha oh, oh, ha oh. ha. I am D Helm the grass cutter. Give me a lawnmower, I'm very deadly. And there's a fairy. She will heal all your health. If you need it but I don't I'm just cutting her grass ha 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 de hell the grass cutter and apparently sword clinker clink 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 oh I can't cut the pretty flowers and killing more choo choos. And my computer finally shut off. It's weird. Blow. Noise. I guess. That sounded a bit weird in my head, so uh, I'm gonna say it's exhaust. I don't know, it's making some weird noise, but it stopped. So, look, I'm not going to attack that. I can't figure out how to attack that yet, besides for using magic on it. Which you get for going in here. Double, double, toil and trouble. What is this, Harry Potter 3? A toadstool mixed makes powder for tricks. Okay. Let's give her a toadstool. Ah, it has the sleepy toadstool. It does. Well, mix it up something in a jiffy. We will. Well, holy crap. I'm not even speeding this up. It's all ready. It is. Take care, as there's not much there. Why not try a bit in my hut? Okay, sure, why not? We've got some magic powder. Try sprinkling it on a variety of things. Like this. It turns on lights. Good job. Use it on your enemies and see what happens. If you run out, go to the forest, pick some mushrooms, and I will make you more. Why, thank you. But I will stick to going in dungeons and doing that. But yeah, that's the... This is the... 
What? Hey, mom. Okay, then. And I died again. Crap. That's lame. That was just a bit weird, though. Hey, mom? What was up with that? I thought that's how you killed him. Okay, so I'm completely clueless on how you kill that thing. Because if you get regularly attack it, it electro electrocutes the heck out of you. Oh well, I'll probably figure it out later. Wow, this looks pretty heavy. You won't be able to lift it. Grrrg. And now we have to go get the key. Luckily, I knew what I was doing. I'll go ahead and show you what happens if you don't use magic powder on this guy. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. Heh <laughs> heh You're going to be lost, thanks to me. <laughs> so yeah, if you keep going, which I will, eventually, or it will send you somewhere random in the mysterious forest. Which is crap. And if you go back, of course, it will be like the regular map. So, I'll just keep going up. And to the left. I already got 84 rupees, so that's good. To the left again. And up. But it's completely random where he sends you. And now he's spinning. Holy crap, oh, what? what the heck's going on? Magic powder is not supposed to do this. The last thing I can remember is buying into big juicy toadstool. Then I had the darnest stream. I was a raccoon. Yeah, so strange, but it sure was fun. Well, okay then. I'll talk to you. I'm all tuckered out. I think I better set a spiel before I hit him. Well, you do that, because you look like you know magic. You look like a messed up type of Mario. And yeah, so now you can go back this way. Cut those to go on behind it. And we got the tail key. Now you can open the tail cave gate. Hoops, take the key and go to the tail cave. Retrieve the instrument that is hidden there. Go now, the wind fish is waiting. Hoot. Okay, the wind fish can wait. Let's see what's up here. And there was a golden acorn. Kapongo Swamp and the Mysterious Forest. Kapongo Swamp is the next dungeon, if I'm correct. So, we don't need to go there. We will go ahead and go to Tail Cave. I don't know. It might have been. Well, actually, never mind. I don't really have to cut this off until uh, I get to the cave. But I'm going to go ahead and cut it off once I get to the cave. Only because I still don't want these videos to be very long. And since I am voice recording as I play the game, it is sort of hard to know my time limit because usually if I'm ready to cut it off um, I can see that it is about time when I am uh, voicing over the already filmed footage or gameplay sorry and he said we had to go south, didn't we? Crap. South. And my, uh, computer's making that weird noise again. Oh yeah, you can go over here. Terran's taking a nap at home. I don't know how he can sleep on such a nice day. It is making me want- It makes me want to sing a song. Yes, the song is Ballad of the Windfish. Let's listen to this real quick.
you can actually walk around as it's going on. Because you can leave. She doesn't really stop. I wonder if you talk to her if she stops. Nope, she just keeps going. So, let's continue. And it was south that we were supposed to be going. And it's not that way. South. Further south. Gotta find some cave. Die, you stupid, uh, pea shooters. I don't know. They... They're the things from Zelda, the original SNES, or NES version. SNES, really? And here we are. Here's Tail Cave. So, that is all for this video. I will see you all next time on Let's Play Link's Awakening DX. I just remembered that. This is not the original Game Boy version. It's the uh, Game Boy Color. So yeah, see you next time, and let's play Link's Awakening DX. Bye.